Two North Park mom and pop businesses remain closed a month after a fire damaged their buildings. Our ABC 10's reporter John Horn has the positively San Diego help the owners are now getting from neighboring businesses. Antonio Hernandez and his family were on the way to church on December 12th when they got a nightmare phone call. He asked, you know, what was going on in your building? I said, well, what do you mean? So there's, there's smoke coming out of your windows. It was the same smoke they could see from the 805 freeway. Their fears confirmed when they got to their space on University Avenue. It, it really was one of, well, it was a really difficult time. A fire had broken out in the building Antonio's mental health clinic, Saluna Wellness, shares with Mr. Brown's barbershop. The two mom and pops have been closed since the fire. And to make matters worse, Antonio and his wife Emerson had just spent upwards of six figures transforming their side, a former co-working space, into an inviting studio. It's hard to look at. It's hard to look at, you know. Um, it's, um, we poured our heart and soul into it, so, <laughs> excuse me. But now, others in this close-knit North Park business community are stepping up. Next week, Verbena Kitchen, right across the street, is hosting an all-evening happy hour to raise money for Saluna and Mr. Brown's. Area businesses have donated beer and cider to the event, plus items to raffle. We can only do so much, you know, but when we join together as a community, you know, we, we're unstoppable, and we're seeing that here. To have um, the support from, from our community, to have the support from fellow business owners is, is huge for us. Antonio says it's what keeps him going in this situation. John Horn, ABC 10 News. We reached out to the city for an update on the fire investigation. We're still waiting to hear back. In the meantime, the fundraiser at Verbena Kitchens begins at 4 p.m. Thursday on the 20th. All the information you need to know is on our website right now at 10news.com.